During the South Korea's defense ministry, South Korea says it cannot rule out the possibility that China's recent incursion into Korea's air defense zone was intended as a protest against Korea's decision to deploy the THAAD missile defense system. Meanwhile, the U.S. has decided to deploy a special radar to help it detect possible missile launches by North Korea. Kim Jong-soo has the details. The Ministry of National Defense says there's a chance that the intrusion into South Korea's air defense identification zone by 10 Chinese military aircraft on Monday is related to Beijing's opposition to Seoul's decision to deploy the THAAD missile defense system. Defense Minister Han Min-gu acknowledged that possibility Thursday morning when asked by lawmakers at the National Assembly about a connection. China hasn't been the only one making incursions, however. Seoul-based Yonhap News Agency reported on Thursday that Japan entered South Korea's identification zone more than 440 times last year. Both countries' incursions happened near Yeodo, a submerged rock located off the southern coast of Jeju Island, possibly indicating that Yeodo has become a contested zone between China and Japan's air forces. According to Yonhap sources, Japan routinely notifies South Korea in advance of the entries while China repeatedly ignored such protocol, entering the zone 59 times during 2016. Meanwhile, media outlets in the U.S. reported on Wednesday local time that the U.S. military has dispatched a high-tech sea-based X-band radar unit to the Pacific Ocean as part of its larger missile defense system. The radar reportedly left Hawaii on Monday and is headed for an undisclosed area 1,600 kilometers away from the Korean Peninsula. The high-tech radar is able to detect objects more than 2,000 kilometers away. The deployment can be seen in light of comments by outgoing U.S. Defense Secretary Ash Carter, who gave a final address on Tuesday at local time. He said the U.S. plans to monitor North Korea's missile tests, but does not necessarily plan on destroying every missile launched by the regime, only those deemed by the U.S. to be a threat. North Korea issued a statement on Sunday saying it could test fire on intercontinental ballistic missile, quote, anytime and anywhere, on the orders of its leader. Kim Jong-soo, Arirang News.